With Zoom version 5.10.0, it's now possible to share audio to breakout rooms. As I previously shared in this video, Zoom had allowed at the end of 2021 to share screen to breakout rooms. Sharing audio was, however, not possible. This new feature now opens up many new possibilities to communicate between the main room to the breakout room. And at the end of this video, I'm going to share with you what is my preferred use. Hi, my name is Enrico. I'm a trainer, facilitator, and creative engineer. And my mission is to help you become a remote working hero by adopting the technology that works best for you. But first things first, let's install the new Zoom version 5.10.0 or any more recent version depending on when you're watching this video. Open your desktop client, click on your profile picture, then check for updates, and here update to the newest available version. To test out the new Share Audio to Breakout Rooms feature, I've launched a Zoom meeting and connected with four devices. Device 1 is a PC running Windows 10, where I've just updated to Zoom version 5.10.0. Device 2 is another PC running Windows 10, where I've not updated to the latest Zoom version. Device 3 is an iPhone using the Zoom app that has not been updated to the latest release. And device 4 is a MacBook Pro where I have updated to the latest Zoom version. I'm connected as a host from device 1 where I have the latest Zoom version, whereas all other three devices are connected as participants. From the host device I'll click on Share Screen and then make sure that these two options are selected. Share to breakout rooms and Share Sound. So you can now share any media source with sound. For example, a YouTube video from my YouTube channel. Everybody is seeing the video, but who is actually hearing it? Well, it's only the participant on device 4. That is the only other device where I have installed the newest Zoom version. From a MacBook Pro. It was released in April 21. On the PC and iPhone where I don't have the version 5.10.0, the sound does not come through. This is something very important to be aware of. So make sure that if you want to use this feature, all participants are on the newest Zoom version. So you won't create any frustration. If you're liking the video so far, please hit the like button so more people will have the chance to watch it. Thank you. Let's now get to my preferred use of this new feature. If you've planned your breakout room activity in advance and you know what you want people to do, then sharing a video with audio is a perfect way to communicate the exercise instructions. You can pre-record a video of yourself and then share it to all breakout rooms to kick off the activity. Something like that. Welcome to your breakout room. This is a perfect way to share the instructions for the exercise that you'll be doing, let you know how much time you have, and let you know how you can ask for help. Good luck with the exercise and see you back in plenary. If you now want to learn my top 10 advanced Zoom features, check this video here.